Hello, YouTube Business 25 here today. I'm going to play Hello Seafood 2. This is a really, really fun cafe, bistro type game. It's a restaurant themed seafood. But they also have um, some American dishes and they have desserts. So they have a big variety of food. The storage for the food is amazing so you have a lot of storage I upgraded my refrigerator to level 5 and each time you upgrade it doesn't cost like a lot of money like tons and tons of money like other games do these are the to-go order orders people come in and they ask if you have it they pay more for that than just getting the dish by itself so it's better to do that plus you can get uh, to level up and you can get Garbies. I don't have any ham right now. I'm waiting for it to finish. So they have daily quests. All these daily quests every day. They're really easy to do. You can get a lot of stuff from doing that. The food never expires. It never expires at all. So you have, that's why you can have tons and tons of food. They have a little street truck on the side. This has been also easy to level up, even to get the parts. You can buy the parts for Garby, or you can get them from other people's restaurants. So the different ways that you can get them, you can also buy them. But it's pretty easy just to get them. You can get them through this, the lottery machine. You upgrade that. The first time to upgrade that, it was a lot of money. But it's worth it so you get like really good prizes. So if you do 10 at a time, you're more chances of getting better prizes. So with this, you have the option. Once you upgrade, you get... The Americano, the beaded ice cream, and then you level up again, you get the rusted sweet potato and the ice Americano. Every time you upgrade, you get two new things. And then once you use them, you get a percentage off. So every time that you use them and you level them up, so you have like one star, two stars, then it won't cost as much, and then you can get more profits by getting the money. <laughs> Uh, I just recently got the boat, so you can load all the food that you have to the boat. This is a lot better than Cafe World, because they had ridiculous amounts of food that would take forever to cook. These ones don't take as long to cook, like the egg sushi right there, and the spicy soup. So you can load them all up there, or you can save them for your restaurant. So I'm just going to load these ones so that way they're not used and giving them to other people. So my chicken soup is done. You gotta feed the cat, you gotta feed the animals. They also have animals that you could buy too, as well. Like it's, they have the other regular quests. They have the dog, which I bought, the cat, and then they have bunny, and then they have these whales. <laughs> So you get extra bonuses from the whales, too. I made a lot of chicken soup because it's for this. See? Okay, so that's done. And you always get a daily quest for that. So just click on the frying pan, and then you can pick whatever one you want. Then they have the motorcycle, which it comes back and it delivers every three hours. You do that twice a day, then you can get one of the daily quests. You can also upgrade it, and the upgrades haven't been super crazy for that at all yet. They have this test 
is what you do is you do the test and then that's how you upgrade your cafe. So mine is gold right now and you have to do so many per time. It costs money every time that you do it and it costs money the more that you upgrade the more that it will cost you. It's not a lot of money so it's pretty good. Then they have these achievements so you could get a lot a lot of stuff just by doing that stuff. You can always uh, add friends, add new friends, added people. Uh, I'm gonna show me. So you can add me. I uh, put Pua. <laughs> Just because I, I couldn't think of anything else to put, so that's what I put. And I got the Pikachu icon, so you guys can add me if you want to play this game. So they have storage and of course they have things for the shop you can also upgrade these you can upgrade everything in the game which is cool they got big variety there's a lot to do they have different themes which is really cool they have stuff for summer they have like a little pool thing and again like the cost isn't like crazy amount of money. They have expansions, even the expansions don't cost a lot. Different themes. You can do the outside of your fence, which you couldn't do in the other games. You couldn't do that. See, there's a lot of different variety of you can do for your shop. The only thing is that the people don't really have that much variety of stuff for them to wear. It's just kind of, I don't know, they're kind of weird to me. You can change the faces, the hair, and then put different accessories on them. Wake up! Wake up. Okay. And then you have to upgrade these people. You upgrade these people, okay. and then that's how you get different recipes and then they also have the side dish which is all the things that I gotten for free from the lottery so you can all use all these to enhance your dishes you can either get them for free or you can buy them so if you want to add something to your you know whatever you want to add to your dish like okay sweet sour you can also sell what you put on the dish or you can move it around you can move it anywhere you want to you can change the size of it you can <laughs> rotate it like they seriously thought about everything so that's why it's cool See, like this one can use a side dish. It always will say that one. So right now I put this on there and I put this on there. So I could add something else if I wanted to. So like I could put this sweet and sour chicken. If I want. But I think I'm going to put... They have these sushi things. Put on the side, I guess. Oh, I kind of don't like that. So let's sell it. <laughs> okay, I guess that's good enough. So 
so this is all the ones that she can make and then the ones that you need for the ship will have the ship right on the front and you just push cook and you have a space and so you'll get the upstairs will open but you have to get 13 by 13 and then you can get the dessert cafe store and then they have a drone and then they have this over here so there's a lot all right so I'm going to show how to upgrade I have four and then I have three of these so let's upgrade this one and now I'll be able to hold way more so everything that you have you can upgrade Okay, so I've shown all this stuff and how to upgrade it and everything else like that. This is done, so I'm going to put this in there. This is done, I'll put this in there. Alright, so thanks for watching, guys. Thanks for tuning in. If you guys are playing this game, add me on there. And thanks for watching my videos. Thanks for subscribing. Eastside25, out.